everyone, this is Elaine, and I happen to be at a crafty retreat this weekend, this past weekend, and I am doing a little video from there. Um, so I just wanted to give you a little look. This is one set of the tables, and then over there is another set. The time I am videoing this, it's a little early in the morning, so no one is up yet. Um, they are mostly scrapbookers, so I will not show you what's on their tables. Um, you know, it's usually pictures of family and stuff, and I don't want to invade. Um, but I did want to show you one of the projects that I finished this weekend, and it's some of my suitcases. So one by one, I'm going to open them and show you what I have done inside. Now this one, I don't know if you can tell or not, but it's pretty big. <laughs> and this is something I have never done before. And it is a wallpaper. Um, I like it. Everybody liked it. Um, but I don't know. I think I still need to work on my skills <laughs> with using wallpaper. Um, but anyhow, that's that one. Then the one that looks just like it, but a little smaller, I used maps. And I used the maps that had a lot of green on them for the land and cities and stuff like that. This one I really liked, and it was probably one of everybody's favorites. And um, if you've watched me for a while, you know that I live in Georgia, and it just so happens that I picked up the atlas and the pages from Georgia. So what's in here is a lot of the cities from Georgia. I think pretty much I used nothing but actually. Um, so that was a happy little accident and coincidence. So I thought, way to go, Elaine. Now this suitcase here, I picked up I'm not sure exactly where, um, but I got it super cheap. It's a little beat up. Well, it was very beat up. Um, on this one, it did have a cut, so I just did a little patch on it and going to call it a day for the outside on that one. But this one, I also used wallpaper. Excuse me, but what I did was I used a roll of wallpaper so I went around the edge with a strip or many strips and then I cut a whole piece to size so this one I think is beautiful um, it's like the right color for that blue and anyway so that is what one of the projects that I did and um, I will show you another one I finished another hinge journal and then I got some other things I'm working on. I've been very productive this weekend. So if you ever get a chance to come to an artsy retreat, even if it is with people that don't do what you do, go. You'll meet some new friends, some lifelong friends, and you. I think you'll really enjoy yourself. So remember, I do try to put up a video every... Tuesday at 6 p.m. Eastern Time. And of course, I have a Twitter, I have an Instagram, um, I'm on Facebook, a group, a page, my own personal one. Um, and come and check me out. And uh, yeah, that's me. And I'm going to go back up to my, to my room now and get me a shower and get ready for the day. Um, this retreat was Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, and Monday. So it's been a pretty long one, and um, but we're all still liking each other and having fun. So anyhow, I do appreciate it very much, and I will check you out going down the road. Bye!